So here we go. James the Machine Dean out front, your two-time defending champion, our your current points leader. James the Dean initiates. Good angle from him. Kevin Lawrence, some wavering there, shimmies his way up the bank about halfway through as James Dean now transitions into that second outer zone. And he is just putting his car in exactly where it needs to be. The judges, of course, impressed with that as Kevin Lawrence hunts that inside clip. Ryan, James the Machine Dean makes it look really, really easy. Well, it's got a tall order here for Kevin Lawrence uh, after a pretty good chase run here. You can see one point of difference is that Dean was super high on the bank, very close all the way around. And he kept that throttle on through that first inside clip, entered deep into the second outside zone, pretty much stayed there. Lawrence starts to make up some ground here on that second inside, or the second outside bank rather, comes up a little bit tight on that inside clip and uh, tried to gain some proximity there towards the end. He will go to the lead now as James Dean will chase him down. So he's gonna have to fight to try to have a comparable lead run to James Dean on what was a pretty flawless start there for the two-time champ. Kevin Lawrence will now lead James Dean giving chase. We have yet to hear the, the verdict between Castro and Carney. I actually, that fault. I was gonna wait, actually, okay. no, I know, no, no, that, I know, but I'll, I'll tell you, and then we The can. suspense is killing me, Ryan. Please <laughs> do tell, do tell. No, I can't. No, no, he's, he, Ryan, Ryan Sage is really building up the suspense in my mind. No, don't tell me, don't tell me. Here we go, Kevin Lawrence versus James Dean. Kevin Lawrence out front. Line up those tires into that first outside zone. Again, another, another dominant, oh, Kevin Lawrence drops down quite a bit there on that first outside zone, past that front clip. Into that second outer zone. And there is James Machine, Dean. Right there on the door of that S chassis, bringing around that final clip. And Ryan, uh, James, making me nervous, very similar to that we saw of, uh, uh, previously we saw that from uh, S as well. Yeah, he started off pretty low on the bank there, and uh, Kevin Lawrence was not super high on the bank. That could have been a, b a point of difference there uh, in the comparison of the lead from Lawrence and the chase from Dean, but now Dean, Gets really close to Lawrence on the inside bank. This was something that Lawrence really didn't have in his attack and his approach. James Dean does miss that final outside zone, uh, whereas Kevin Lawrence did fill it. So we'll see how the judges take both runs into account there as we take a look on board here with Castro and uh, Dean Kearney. Oh, uh, they're, they're having some heated words here. All right, so Castro and Kearney. All right, so some heated words there, wondering what uh, what what was said there. It seemed that you know, I, I just you would have to think that the dialogue was maybe like, give me a little bit of room, or do this or that. Who knows? But Kevin Lawrence, James Dean, slide him left for Lawrence or right for James Dean. It's unanimous. The champ continues. So we have all four, actually five of our points leaders right now. Again, Forsberg there in fifth, Odie in fourth. Pietzer Visig there in third, Osbo in second, and James Dean continues on leading the points and leading his charge. Yeah, the one thing I did hear from uh, Dean Carney was you're supposed to run a 100-point run, so I'm wondering what if that was uh, correctly heard what he was implying uh, there, and perhaps 